The population is growing in Florence, and we are growing with new schools for new students. Our building plan is a systematic approach based on a stewardship plan with short-term bonds. The pay-as-you-go plan enables each school to be paid for in full before the bell rings on the first day of class in a new facility. Facility needs are based on two criteria, population growth and program growth within the schools. Our children are maturing in a technology-based world and state-of-the-art facilities are vital to keep pace and provide the best possible educational environment. Happening now, Phase 1. The 2012-2013 school year is the first year of occupancy for the state-of-the-art Lucy T. Davis Elementary School, currently enrolling over 400 students from kindergarten through fourth grade with the capacity for 900 students. Next door, the construction project is underway for the new intermediate school. It will be ready for grades five and six for the 2013-2014 school year with a capacity for 1,300 students. This facility will replace more intermediate. This is an exciting time for not only the parents, students, faculty, and staff of Moore Intermediate School, but also the Florence community. In the summer of 2013, we will be relocating to a brand new facility, which is located right next door to the Lucy T. Davis Elementary School. And this school is going to be state of the art. It's going to provide many opportunities for students to participate in the latest and up-to-date technology, not only in the technology labs, but also in the classrooms as well. We are going to have a 6,000 square foot cafeteria, which will accommodate at least 400 students at one time, which will help alleviate the wait lines um, for students being served. We're going to have a fine arts area where students will have the opportunity to participate in music, art, chorus, orchestra, and drama, and other activities as well. In our gym, which will also accommodate 1,200 students, um, we're going to use this for physical education classes, assemblies, and also for hosting community events. So you can see we're very excited about our brand new school and look forward to making history when we enter the doors in August of 2013. Construction trucks and workers are also working on a new North Vista Elementary School with an expected completion date in the fall of 2014. North Vista will be the largest elementary school in the history of Florence One, with a capacity for 1,200 students, grades kindergarten through sixth grade. The REACH and Montessori programs will be located here. I'm very excited about having a new school here at North Vista Elementary School. The quality of a new school facility is going to positively affect us in so many ways. It's going to affect the educational outcome here at North Vista Elementary. As for the students, the students will really get a strong message from the community and from the district that this building is so important and that they value the education of students here at North Vista. As for the teachers, the enthusiasm is going to pre-made and they're going to have such pride in their new facility. They can now teach the content and not worry about the facility itself. As for the community, a new school reinforces community pride and community life and spirit. As for me, I'm just so excited to have a new school here at North Vista. I just cannot wait. I've been here 16 years and I'm just excited to have a new building, positive attitudes from students, teachers and faculty and staff members as well as from the community. A new Royal Elementary School will be built on the current Moore Intermediate site. More will be replaced to build a brand new elementary school for kindergarten through sixth grade. The student capacity for this facility is 900. This location will allow zoning to remain the same for the elementary families currently attending Royal. The projected completion date is December 2014. What a wonderful opportunity the Royal community is uh, quickly approaching as we begin the construction of the new Royal Elementary School. Royal um, has a proud heritage. It's been on the current location, on the current site for 63 years. And since that time, it has proudly served students that have gone on to become great um, leaders in our community and across the state. And as we approach the future, we are excited about the opportunity to move to a building where we can accommodate the needs of our children in terms of technology, 
uh, and just facilities. We have 19 portables now, so almost half of our students are in portable units. Um, we have begun the design phase and the staff is actively involved. I think the community is going to be thrilled with the location and with the way the building uh, not only preserves the heritage of Royal, but speaks to the future of Royal. A former private school property has been purchased by Florence School District 1, located on Ashby Road. Florence 1 will configure the use of this structure in its future facility needs. Phase 2 Phase two of the building plan comprises construction plans for four schools and will begin in the following order in 2014. Delmay Elementary is first on the list for phase two. A brand new elementary school will be built on the existing site, housing kindergarten through fifth grade with a student capacity of 900. Florence One will build a new Southside Middle School located on Paul Jones Road with a student capacity of 1300. Williams Middle School and Savannah Grove Elementary will complete Phase 2. Both schools will be brand new and their site locations are now under consideration. Florence One is a fiscally conscious school district and building projects are based on need and efficient planning. Our first class community needs first class facilities for our children. School facilities are powerful indicators of our community's values and aspirations, and Florence One is confident that this building plan will enhance the learning environment for all ages.